I'm honestly so terrified. I cannot believe that there's a rattlesnake in the house. I don't even like want to be here anymore. Like I, I'm scared to live here. I think the, uh, the snake just bit. Snake. The in a yeah. backyard. So the animal control came. So hits right up there. He's looking for the rattlesnake right now. We have a rattlesnake? Yeah. Bob, it was, we've uh, been up there. I looking know. For the I know. So it was in the neighbor's house and they called the animal control. Guys, don't go out. You guys could get bitten. And I guess he went into a yard. No way. Yeah. No and they just way. told the guy that it's here in our yard. So I'm gonna go up there and see what's up. No signs? Should make a noise, right? Oh yeah. He's saying that the neighbors saw the snake coming to our yard. He was ringing the bell. I was able to see him through the camera. And I saw he had like a little badge right here and I was like, what's going on? And the and police? I, thought, I was like, is it the police? And then he had a shovel and I was like, how is he a cop if he has a shovel in his hand? So I don't think he found the rattlesnake. Oh my God. I didn't see it. No? Yeah. But you do have some holes up there where the snake, if it wanted to, I mean, it could go into the hill and or the uh, hole. And then um, they um, uh, underground for a bit, but um, you know, I mean, just just uh, be a little careful, you know. I guess if it, like I mean, if because they're gonna be in the slide and things like that, because there you know, is a possibility if the snake is still on your property that it could be like um, probably on the back side of your um, slide up there. Yeah. But um, like I said, I'm not seeing anything right now. Should I just go and do the same thing you were doing? Try to catch it. I mean, it's a rattlesnake? Do, yeah, yeah. It's like a five year old rattlesnake. And so it's probably like four or five feet long, roughly. So, four or five feet? But um, there's a good possibility that w what it did was just went along your uh, wall and then maybe like went into your neighbor's yard too. Okay. So. Well, thank you for coming. Yeah, no problem. Yeah, because when it's warm like this, this is when the uh, snakes come out. And, uh, People find them in the front yards or even in the backyard. He didn't catch it. Is that mean it's still in her house? So I guess the snake's still. We have a rattlesnake in our backyard. It, yeah. I have to look for it every day. No. I no. have to, cause what if you guys step on it? We just won't go outside. It's that easy. We won't go outside. No, no. we not be. And outside. live in the house forever. And I use a pool. Yeah, or the playground. To be honest, yeah, it's, the, it's that easy. At the basketball, I'd rather risk not going in the pool than risk by dying. He's definitely. I feel not safe him leaving. Like, can he not leave till he finds it? That'd be nice. <laughs> That'd be nice. If he but can you just too. live with us till you find the rest? Yes. <laughs> no, he's actually leaving. We can die. But if we have one rattlesnake here, imagine how many more rattlesnakes there are. How did he even get it here? It was in the neighbor's house. How did they get there? How did they get there? Because there's neighbor's holes. There's holes on the I don't know. Like, so it was probably know. living in some yeah. hole. I'm honestly so terrified. I cannot believe that there's a rattlesnake in the house. It could like literally bite any of us. What are we, what are we going to do? I'll just go and look for it. So what if it comes inside the house? I know. So I'm just gonna go look for it right now. I have to, until I find it, I guess. What if you don't find it? What about if you find it and it bites you or something? You the guy said if that happens, just call 911. Because if I just rush to the hospital, I there's a high possibility that I don't make it, like, safely. Wait, but isn't he supposed to wait till he actually finds it, especially when there's so many kids around? Uh, I don't know. Their policies. 
I don't even like want to be here anymore. Like I, I'm scared to live here. I mean, yeah. Especially but the good thing is about rattlesnakes is that when you get close to them, they rattle the, the tail. And that's how you know they're right there and you run away. Yeah, well then we gotta go talk to the kids and let them know yeah. that. Because they don't know that. We've never encountered a rattlesnake before. I would never think that this place would have rattlesnakes. I know. Guys, okay, so we're coming outside in hopes that we find the rattlesnake. Um, we left the kids inside just in case. Now at this point, we have no idea where it could be. So my husband has this stick and I guess that's... Is that, what are you going to do with that stick? Is that it. like your protection or something? No, it's just to get it. That's like the mop stick for those of you wondering. Babe, have you seen me running? No, if you see me running, <laughs> then you run. Okay, well I have your sandals. Sorry guys, we were not prepared to make this video, but we thought we wanted to share it with you guys so you guys can... I don't know, snake. experience this with us. Stay away from the snakes, guys. If you guys see a rattlesnake or any type of snake in your house, make sure you guys stay away from them and call Animal Control or 911. Babe, I don't think I can climb the hill. Oh, I think the neighbors are still also looking for the rattlesnake. Honest, I don't look for it. Yeah, they're looking oh, for the um, rattlesnake. Yep. Oh my god, he's saying that it was on that side and that it was huge. He said to be careful that he that the rattlesnake was really really mad. Oh my god guys. So he's saying that the rattlesnake was super mad and that was rattling its tail and that he didn't he wasn't able to get it so it jumped on our yard and now that they they curl up like this and then they hide so now he's just saying to be very careful because they're very dangerous he's saying if i if he touches the rattlesnake that rattlesnake's going to be very upset oh my god i'm scared okay guys so I'm going to go inside. My husband's gonna stay out here looking for it just because he wants to feel safe that uh, it's not longer here. We think it's still here. The neighbors think it's still here, but they think that it's either blending in or inside a hole. So the kids will not be going outside today. So I guess he's gonna look for the rattlesnake. Um, I mean, his goal is to find it. I'm gonna go see what the kids are doing. I know they're like terrified right now. I say hi. He's been having a rough morning. I think he's getting sick or something. Guys, yeah. guess what? So we didn't find the rattlesnake. Okay. Your dad is outside. Have you guys looked out the window? He has like a stick. You're kidding. No, I'm not. Right there, that little white. That's him. I'm just scared because what I told him, what if it bites you? And he's like, well, if it bites my leg, I just won't be able to move it for one whole month. Babe, be careful. Love you. Good luck. Guys, I don't know what's happening, but my husband told me to come out. What? Babe, what? Um, I think the, uh, the snake just bit. Los pájaros, las palomas, ¿cómo se llaman? Dove. Because there is one. That is the kind of walk. Yeah, watch. Oh my god. Wait, but how would you be able to tell if it bit him or not? Because he cannot walk, look. He can't fly, it's barely walking. I don't know, let me. It was right there, barely moving. Look. Wait, should you call the animal control again so they come back out? Since they bit him? I don't know if he's dying. Babe, oh my gosh. No vuela. Por eso la agarra aquí. And what are you gonna do? I'm just gonna. Oh, I'm gonna cry. Oh, I don't want it to die. Okay, I'm going back inside just in case the rattlesnake is here. Okay. What the heck? 
Sue's going to be very sad when she sees him not flying. Sue! Yeah? Look. We think the Hello. snake bit a uh, birdie. Oh, no. Let me grab it. Please, please, please. Let me grab it. Let me grab it. Please, please, please. please. Let me grab it. Let me grab it. Let me grab it. Grab it. We, think, we think the rattlesnake bit, bit him. Is no. it a girl or a boy? No puede volar. That's a girl. Be careful, guys. Be careful. Be careful. Okay. Try to give it your water. Alright. I'm gonna look for the bear snake. Babe, I think we should take her to the vet. Yeah. Do you want you want me to take her? Let's try. Let's go. Give her water first. I don't know he what have, the. He has one wing. Ask That's him. so weird. Isn't that weird? It's like our third. Yeah, because first we took care of the puppy that came in here. Don't grab it, okay? And now we're taking care of the bird that we this think is so the rattlesnake bit her. So what we're gonna do, guys, is we are gonna give the bird a little bit of water. We're gonna see how the birdie feels. And if it's still not feeling okay, we're gonna take um, the bird to the vet. It's really close to us, so we'll take the bird to the vet and we will know if the rattlesnake bit her or not. Alrighty, so I'm about to call the veterinarian and kind of ask what we should do at this point because I don't know. I've never had a bird before. So, and I've never especially had a bird that was bitten by a rattlesnake, or at least that we thought was bitten by a rattlesnake. So I'll call the vet and ask her what are the signs. Like, is there any early signs of a rattlesnake bits you? How do birds act? She can't fly. So, we're going to uh, give it some water. We'll put it in this thing because yeah, yeah, yeah. it's tiny. Okay, so here's going to be some water. So it's not really drinking any water. I think it's scared. I, yeah, so put it down and see if it'll drink water then. I'm gonna go see what my husband's up to. A few hours and my husband actually changed his attire and now he is in a shirt and a hat. Um, it looks like he's gonna be out here for a while. I am going to be taking the bird to the vet. They re recommended that we take the bird and see if a rattlesnake actually bit him or if he's not flying for another reason. So we'll know once we take him to the vet. I'm gonna go upstairs right now and see if the kids are ready. Oh. <laughs> Hopefully we could get the bird some help because that is very sad that he can't fly. What, <laughs> what was that? I'll have a look into my eyes and never let